Hey guys, this is Star Care Bear, and um, I just wanted to make a video um to kind of update my um my whole um status of just my health and stuff like that. Um, so I went back to the doctor. Want to say what's today? A couple days ago, I can't remember. Was it Friday? I think I went to the doctor. Sunday today, and um, yeah, and um, so I went back because, as you guys know, you know, um, the bleeding came back. It was gone for maybe, I think a couple days, like almost a week, five days, six days, and I went back to the same thing. So, um, I went back to the doctor and um, I was hoping that. Um, she would tell me that, um, I would be able to get some type of procedure done, you know, to stop the bleeding or something, but she says that, uh, right now, I guess the only thing that she's really recommending is for me to take birth control pills, so... I started those yesterday yeah yesterday so we'll see how it goes um I've never had to take birth control for like birth control I've took birth control in the past for you know just my whole regular irregular periods and stuff like that so but yeah so we'll see how this goes um that had been like a long time ago so, um, they did, like, my work on my blood and stuff like that, and uh, I got the lab work here, because they, they print you out, like, a sheet of, you know, stuff like that, and so, like, the last time I was there, my, um, hemoglobin, or blood count, like, a month ago, was... My hemoglobin was 14.7, and this time my hemoglobin went down to 9.2. So she said it was still not bad enough for like a blood transfusion, but obviously my blood is bad. And my weight last time I was weighing 431, and this time I weighed in at 432 so I gained a pound since last time 432 okay you know I teeter totter around the 430 mark I don't know what it is about me I just don't know what it's I just remember when I did Jenny Craig I had lost like 30 pounds I was like 399 I was in the 300s and then I went back and gained it just stuck with it but anyway so i'm going to show you guys basically all the crap that i'm taking and um here we go you see this whole container is everything that i'm taking it's i pulled out the drawer and um so first of all show you this is the compact for the birth control so there you go if you've never seen birth control pills um you guys can see I took two already and you put it on the date and how it works is that if you guys can see there's all these blue pills right there and then you get towards the end and there's, I want to say, I think it's seven. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, seven um, green pills, like right here. And the blue pills is what, I guess, is the real pill. And the greens are just sugar pills. And that's when you end up getting your period. Yeah, when you take that. But 
the doctor said that I would just skip the green pills and start a new a new set because um, since I've been bleeding so much she kind of wants me to skip a, a period so that is it it's kind of a plain little compact I was telling Alan that I want to put like little Hello Kitty stickers or something <laughs> why I don't know <laughs> personalize my birth control anyways so that is that and then she um ordered me two of the they come in this little these are the refills i guess this is called ortho tricycline so there's two more that she gave me then obviously refills and stuff so this was what it came in originally the little instructions are in here here's a little thing uh there's side effects to this it gives you it gives you or it could give you a blood clot which sucks um the risk is higher if you're a smoker i'm not a smoker so i just have to be cautious of i guess letting my blood circulate she told me if i had any side effects to obviously you know not stop taking it or stop taking it but get in contact with her so then um she gave me this um this is a box of iron pills i guess that's what it's called it's ferrosulfate i don't know so since i have my um really low blood count i have to start taking these iron pills they look like that you take three a day three pills a day so there you go this daily intake of iron okay alrighty then so let's see and with that I guess one of the side effects of taking iron is that it makes you constipated which I already have dysautonomia I already have thyroidism I already have other diseases that makes it hard for me to doo doo okay basically let's not sugarcoat it i really have a hard time um digesting because of the fact that the we have muscles in our stomach that helps us to digest and basically mine are just don't do that the nerves whatever it doesn't work so it's really sucky because i really have to change my diet a lot of the stuff that i eat like as far as like ground beef is very hard for me to digest um i try not to eat a lot of ground beef because i feel like it stays in my stomach for a long time and um there's other foods like um that just harden in my stomach and just feel like there's a rock in my stomach so they gave me these pills that are supposed to make me doo-doo and um i guess it's um i don't know if it's colase or something what is it let me see what she wrote on here yeah it's colase so i'm supposed to take two a day of this stuff and let's see what else i have to take um right now for my cramping i'm taking these um naproxen pills because i have really bad cramping so i tend to take i want to say up to like four of those a day because i get horrible severe cramping and stuff like that okay and i think those are the only like new medications that she really like got me on because these are like my old um these are my thyroid medications right here I have two bottles because one I take 200 the other one is 25 and they still need to get my dosage correct so this is my thyroid medication that I've been taking like for ever since I was like 18 and then this other medication is a um, birth no the same birth control this is um high blood pressure 
so it's supposed to bring my blood pressure down. Apparently, I have had high blood pressure. And then I take this, this for diabetes. It's called Metformin. I take a thousand um, twice a day. As you can see, it's just a white pill. And I'll take that. Let's see what else I take. Um, yeah, and as far as um, that goes, that's what I do. Um, I sometimes take some type of like natural vitamins. Like this is um, cinnamon, cinnamon tablets that are supposed to help you with your diabetes. So I take these. They're like that. They're just cinnamon pills, and um, they're supposed to help you with your diabetes. I don't know if it does or not, but this one has chromium in it, chromium, so that one helps you to lose weight too. So it's a thousand. It's called cinnamon, cinnamon, chromium. And let's see what other pills I take. Um that are like on my own. This is um, a B12. I take a B12 for energy and these are the gummy, the gummy type ones. Um, let's see what else I have in my thing. I try to take some biotin. Biotin is for, um, it's for healthy skin, hair, and nails. And that is all the pills that I take as far as the ones that aren't prescri prescribed but are vitamin type. And then these are my insulins. This is my Lantus. So this I take twice a day, 50 50 so you twist it it's got a little number here you just go up and up and up and up and up wait so once it hits 50 there it goes 50 and then you just push it in and stuff like that so that's that and then that's twice a day then this one is my Nova, what is it? No, Humalog. This one, you basically um, take it with your meals. So this one is three times a day. And, um, you know, with the pens, you use, um, this is a box of needles, pen needles. So the needles are like this. And you attach them to the top of the pen. And, um, yeah, and then, um, I also got a box of syringes because, um, I also have vials of insulin, so these are the syringes, and come in these little baggies, so these are single-use syringes, which sometimes, if I run out, I'll use old syringes, which... They say you shouldn't, but since I'm like the only one using it, those are it. And that's it. Those are, that's all the medicine that I'm taking right now. And um, hopefully I will be able to like come off of some of this medication when I get healthier because I hate popping pills and, and doing insulin. So. The doctors say if I manage to lose enough weight that I might end up getting to the point where I won't need insulin and I could just take pills and that would be so awesome for me to do and stuff like that. So I'm hoping that the birth control will kick in because I really, I'm so tired of bleeding guys. It's so horrible. I just can't deal with it. I'm just so tired all the time. I have like no freaking energy to do anything. So yeah guys, um, let me know in the comments below um, if you guys take medications. Another thing too is like I didn't have any um, depression pills but sometimes I get prescribed some so I don't know I might be getting 
some, but I hope not. I will see later because I had to go see, uh, when I went to the doctor, I had to go see a counselor because the doctor felt like I needed to. So, because she sees how depressed I am. So, yeah. Um, so, in the comments below, let me know what kind of medications you take natural or um, prescribed medications and what they what they help you with what are their side effects um anything like that just um you don't have to you know you might not want to be open with your illnesses and stuff like that but i'm pretty open with mine because i feel like if i can help somebody else that's sick or going through something then it's just better that way but all right guys i will talk to you soon hopefully feel better next time i see you guys Okay, bye.